Good morning, Sagas. This is Drake Hugo reporting for SNN. As our society enters a more technologically based world, the William S. Hart School District has considered replacing bulky, outdated textbooks with new and efficient iPads. What are the pros and cons of this idea? Would it be feasible at Sagas? Let's take a look. We must find out where the money would come from. According to the LA Times, the LA Unified School District, who have begun to distribute iPads to students, use school construction bonds to fund the billion dollar project. A sustained cost of about four and a half million dollars a year is what needs to be dedicated to, to our district if we wanted to go with tablets. There's many different funding sources a district uses. Um, for instance, through grants, the, the governor this year gave a, a bunch of money. Also had the Wish Foundation for our district. The LA Unified School District also found hidden costs in textbook licenses as well as numerous expenses and damages. When they finally deliver them, we all have to understand that it's not going to be perfect. From day one, it won't be perfect. We can't expect that students aren't going to try and, and, and hack it or try to vandalize it in a way. I, I think there'll be a new realm of consequences for students that are doing that. Students do need to understand that they these tools are there for their education and they need to treat them as if they were their own. There are also other issues, including disabling game and recording functions, teachers being unreceptive to the idea, and perhaps even an abandonment of student penmanship. However, there are many benefits to this iPad movement. You, it is an e-book reader. It's an internet communicating device. It's um, essentially a personal computer with a very small form factor that you can fit into your bag. There's no denying that iPads at Saugus come with a host of problems, but the project is still in the developmental process. Although it would be a neat way to bring iPads and 21st century technology to the classrooms, for now, we should stick with our hard copy textbooks. Reporting for SNN, this has been Drake Hugo. Have a great day, Saugus.